Hey YouTube Opinionated Reviewer here, bring you guys some videos, yes, on iOS 6. If you guys haven't known, Apple actually announced iOS 6 today, and it's actually in the beta stages right now. If you want to get it, you're going to have to register your UD ID as soon as a way without, as soon as a way comes up that you can do it without registering UD ID. I'll definitely do a video on that, but until then, you're going to have to register your UD ID. Links is going to be in the description for that if you want to do it. I haven't started doing it yet. Soon as I start doing it, I'll put the link in the description. Just follow me on Twitter so I'll keep you guys updated. But first of all, this first video, we're going to go ahead and talk about the infamous Facebook. Facebook finally got integration into iOS 6 or even into iOS on a whole. You know, in iOS 5, they actually introduced Twitter to it, and now they introduced Facebook, which is uh, pretty cool. Uh, we, we had that from jailbreak tweaks, but it's good that they got it now. So first of all, let's go ahead and run through it. And the first and one of the main ones is actually into the App Store. You can it, it was actually into the App Store, and it's highly integrated in the app, so you can go ahead and share apps and stuff from that. So I'm going to just pull it up here and just click on any of these apps. Let's go ahead and click on this free app right here. And this is a beta, so if you're actually using it and it's slow or buggy, that's expected. So I could just touch this button, I could go ahead and post to Facebook, which I'm going to do, and then we're going to go ahead and check it out after I'm finished with our, our post and everything to Facebook. So let's just go ahead and take a screenshot of this one time. And you guys just heard a sound right there. I wish they had a different sound than that. Uh, obviously, you can change it, but the Twitter one is, is so unique with the little whistle and stuff like that. And I'm going to go ahead and share this photo to Facebook as well. You can see all of the UI changes and stuff like that which I'm gonna go ahead and and go through I'm just gonna just put anything there and just hit post and my when I go through my last video is gonna be full overview and what's new and what's new about it but I'm gonna do separate videos of uh, all of the stuff you can also it's also integrated into your notification center so you guys can see right here I can actually go ahead and post from my notification center and just say testing iOS 6 or whatever and just hit post for that and I could go ahead and also go to YouTube and do the same thing so I'm over here YouTube I could just hit the share button just go ahead and post this video another test again and just hit post there you go with that sound again and uh, it's also integrated into iTunes so if you like sharing music and you don't care nothing about apps definitely good for you French Kiss I don't even know who the hell that is I just pulled up a random thing go ahead and you could go ahead and post that all of that stuff I just shared to Facebook and we're gonna go ahead and go over to my Facebook now and check it out and see if it was actually posted so let's just go ahead and refresh this you guys can see I was fooling around with it earlier so you can see French Kiss is right there Test why I tested, I posted a video so I could just go ahead and tap that. It's going to load up. I hit play. This is the, the um, post that I sent. And also, this is the app. I can also go ahead and update my Facebook status with Siri, which I'm going to do in a different video. When I'm covering Siri, I can say, do the same thing with Twitter. You can go ahead and comment in here and configure it how you want to. If you don't want it to access all your stuff, you can just go ahead and turn those on and off. And whatever app that Facebook wants to access, every time you go, whenever you go to that app, a one time you're going to have to go ahead and say yes or no if you want it to access me. I really don't like Facebook to access my contacts or whatever. I'm not really caring about that, but the App Store is definitely one and probably is def definitely the Photos app and stuff like that. But that's basically the gist of the Facebook integration. If you're familiar with the iOS 5 and the Twitter integration, then you're going to definitely be familiar with this. It's more or less the same places anywhere to share. It's going to be in Safari as well. I'm not going to go through that, but yeah. That's the overview of the Facebook integration for iOS 6. I'm going to definitely be posting more videos, so definitely look out for those guys. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day.